what's going on everybody welcome back to another episode of guns lock where i show you how to get dreadlocks like some of your favorite celebrities i'm gun the great and today we are going to be looking at wi-fi's funerals dreadlocks now before we get into this video i just recently received you can barely see them up here but i received my play button and another play button for both of my channels so that's really cool and here's a little snippet of me like unboxing it and it was a cool experience for sure i'm super thankful for all you guys you guys are awesome this channel would not be the way it is without you guys oh. guns lock Oh snap! Presented to Gunslock for passing 100,000 subscribers. Do oh, it. this is nice. Wow! So yes, thank you so much for all that. That is amazing. But let's take a look at Wi-Fi's funerals dreadlocks. That's a weird name to say. He does have more of a straighter hair, like maybe a wavy. So we can tell maybe he did do like a crochet hooking or maybe a back combing or one of the straight hair type methods because that's usually what you want to do with straight hair dreadlocks. I only see the dreadlocks right here. You can see one on the front, looks a little more mature. But yeah, over time his dreadlocks are maturing. You can see that they're buttered up at the end. So that's a good thing, but they are super, super, super frizzy. And in this photo, you can see that they're separated, but still frizzy. So even now, like his hair is still frizzy still separated so that's a good thing so that's showing a sign of maturity and the tips are wispy it looks like some of them are knotted up the way Lil Pump does his and like we seen in the last video Lil Pump he actually does interlock his dreadlocks so that's interesting looks like in this picture he even has a rubber band on the tip right there but I think this could even be when he had braids so in this photo you can actually see that he does have braids in so this tells me that he may have even started with braiding and I'll kind of tell you how he got them that way after allowing the braids to set in and everything and then before that his hair was just fuzzy like this but you can see that his hair is very thick so it can grab onto stuff very easily and it is wavy versus straight but for anybody who has this kind of hair texture you would still want to do a straight hair method which would be crochet hooking interlocking twist and rip any of those straight hair methods and the thing is that he could actually even be getting his hair wavy like that from the braids which leads me on to the next thing with his hair being in braids for such a long time and then taking them out he could have allowed his hair to actually develop dreadlocks from the braids but that would be kind of tough seeing how mature his hair is without seeing any sort of braiding structure or pattern on his hair. So what I'm saying is that he did a braid and then he left him in for a while and then he did a braid out which caused the hair to hang on to each other and then that caused it to actually lock up and then he probably assisted with crochet hooking and if he didn't this is just telling you guys if you would like to do this do braids and then do a braid out and assist that pattern if you will with crochet hooking and it'll cause it to lock up. But we can say that his hair type is probably a 2A and the method he chose was braid locks but with a braid out versus allowing the braids to actually lock up. And then the maintenance method could have been crochet hooking. And honestly, even at that point, which the braid out would actually cause the sections, which you could actually even go in with back combing and that could cause the dreads to actually lock up. So with that being said, if you do have a two way hair type, you can go in with braiding, do a braid out, do either one of the straight hair methods, back combing, twist and rip, crochet kneeling, and allow it to lock up. You can even put rubber bands in. You can even start doing interlocking at that point, And then you can get dreads just like Wi-Fi's funeral. But yeah, you guys, that is basically on Wi-Fi's funeral dreadlocks. If you want to get them, just follow those steps that I told you and you'll definitely get to where you need to be. But before I end this video, I want to give a huge shout out to so make sure to comment down below so you can get a shout on the next video other than that give this video a huge thumbs up and comment down who you guys want to see next i'll see you guys next time peace